Hey, what's up? It's Bob Saunders. Uh, back again playing more Approaching Infinity. Uh, this is right after the shipwreck repair update came out. Um, so I'm just testing things, see how they are from a normal play perspective. A few days ago, I started this game right here. Uh, I'm up to Sector 5, medium difficulty permadeath on. Um, I don't have a particular goal other than checking out shipwrecks and how the game plays right now. So uh, one cool thing that I've just done, and so there's, I no one has ever been really super comfortable with skills and gels and things, the way they work out. I mean, sure, some people, uh, maybe you love it, but I'm testing different theories, different ideas. And something some, someone said to me on our Discord was that, like, so you can use skills without having the gel that goes with them. But like, you want the gel to be able to basically let you use a skill again. Like you always expect to be able to use your skills, but you would want them, if you want to spend something on it, then you want to be able to use it again. And which, which weapon does more damage? Uh, I guess the first one, but time for a sword. A sword is a great weapon against zombies. So I have greatly reduced the cooldown on skills. And when I said that on the Discord, people were like, no, I don't think that's the answer. And hey guys, um, you know, maybe you're right, but maybe it will make a heck of a lot of sense. I don't know for sure. I don't want to get surrounded by zombies. I don't want to try it. Uh, so I'll do power strike on this one. Guy. So, Power Strike's gonna pull down in 7 seconds or 7 turns. Ooh, better run away. I didn't kill him. Alright, um, but now I can use it again. And so, like, it, it greatly, greatly changes how those things are handled. Uh, and I'm hoping that people will use the skills more. Ah, we finally figured out why some crafting parts are so hard to find. There's a list of them. They're used to make doors. Now we can create doors in straight ship walls, not corners, with the repair function and those rare parts. All right, cool. I want to repair that. Oh, okay, I can't put a door there. How about right here? Cool, well, look. So I just built the door. So that's something you couldn't do before. Probably pretty darn useful. So like, I just, uh, I just found some red gel, got some. Um, skeletons aren't necessary, I mean, not skeletons. <laughs> My D&D's coming out. Um, what were those guys? Zombies are not necessarily the kind of thing you want to use uh, a spin attack on. I guess unless you have to. Because they, they carry diseases, and I don't want a disease. So I'm gonna power strike the first one. Um, I've got 11 red gel. Uh, and I'm just going to go ahead and use that to cool it down, and I'll probably be able to use it again real soon. All right, he didn't die, but he will now. Now I'm going to use... Oh, I don't have spin attack. And... Nope, don't have spin attack. Was not thinking. So, let's power leap instead. I'll power leap out of there. Oh, and there's more zombies. Good old-fashioned grenade. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Run and gun. And just more zombies. So many bad ideas. Uh, deploy cover. I know how it works. Power leap again. Do I really want to go there? That looks like a safe corner. All right. Yeah, I know cutting damage works. All right, I'll head him off here. Power strike. Boom. He's already hurt. All right, power strike's almost ready to use again. And there it is. I'm not really consuming any gel here. Ah! 
Happened anyway. My secondary attorney was hit and infected with disabling welts. Uh, symptoms include impaired deduction, blank stare, and heightened morality. That's interesting. Heightened morality as a like a disease. I wonder what that does. All right. Well, time to rest. Rest and recuperate. There we go, everybody. I don't think I lost anybody. Nope. All right, you must visit every deck. I'm gonna take this down. I can I can maneuver and power strike these guys. Um, I'm gonna hold on to the red gel. Try this out. All right, so that's where the rest of the zombies are. I might be able to kill this guy before he gets to me. Yep. But that's less to deal with. Cool. Alright. So I definitely feel like I can use my skills more. I'm not entirely sure. Uh-oh. Disease is beginning to show symptoms. Only one crewman is affected. If I could get that one person to die, I'd be out of the disease. <laughs> all right, all right. So that talks about how to treat diseases. There's those guys. I don't really want to deal with them right now. Oh yeah, I have a, uh, I have a, I have a transmuter officer. How am I fixing those floors? Excavator. Do I have an artifact? Do. How am I fixing those floors? Wait, it's Rectech. It's not a transmuter. No. Heck, I don't know. Oh, there it is. It's the first skill I picked. Alright, I see the flash in blue around the screen. I'm gonna head back down to the airlock. Here's the main deck of the ship. Alright, there it is. I'm going to go down a deck and check that out. I know, I don't have anything like that. Oh, there's a sword. No, I mean a, a hammer. Well, I guess I already have the disease. I don't need to worry about catching it. And I can power strike. Zombies are slow, so you can generally stay ahead of them. All right. So, there is no life support. I wonder... Hmm. I guess I'm going to have to continue killing all the monsters and try to get the systems working and just see. See uh, whether the ship's repairable. Cool, there's another, uh... Ooh, spin attack. That's what I wanted. I want that more than I want the uh, running gun. Running gun's useful sometimes. Here we go. Okay. Watch his on. Oh, man. Oh, no, I lost a crewman. Well, that's the end of that. We got nine left. Probably wasn't the infected person. That's not even a system. So we'll go back for oxygen. Seems like the only right thing to do. So I'm gonna leave it alone for now. I'll call that a definite maybe. How are we doing here? Uh, I'm gonna go see. Oh, Tentaculon Station. They should be able to cure my disease. Yes, I will definitely pay that tiny, tiny amount. Replace my lost crewman. 
buy some crafting parts, sell my data, got a fair amount of money, sell some of that loot, um, exactly the same thing I already have, slow armor, don't want that, hmm, I can sell that, pole shears, magnetic boots, oh, crafting lab, well, I'll sell that. Man, that was a high-priced artifact. I guess it's in bag. Oh, they want me to sell an artifact. I don't know what it does. So, I'm pretty sure it doesn't do this. And... I don't know. It doesn't do this either, because I went to a new sector and it didn't do it. Damage bonus on away missions. That's hard to say. Away team heals over time. I'd have to pay attention. I'm not going to make any guesses. The average score is 3%. Human life size. That could be an officer pickup. Oh, look at all that damage. Alright, there's another skill. And it's repair. Wow. Isn't that convenient? Man, I need a fire weapon. The incendiary weapon will work better. I know that. I don't have one. Kinda looks like a fire. The most popular meeting coordinator got hit and infected with yellow death. Sorry, I think you would already have to have. What's that called? Anesthesia? Symptoms, neutron vulnerability, and tight lips. Okay, power strike. Pay attention to what you're doing. Don't lament the state of the world so much. Just try not to get your people killed. Bob. Do that. Yeah, this one's tough. I'm running away. There's the bridge. There's that stranded officer. I don't think I can hire anybody else. I don't have any empty slots. I'm not going to level up anytime soon. Oh, look, this guy can level up. This guy can level up. Hey, do you think I could get more, like, what, warnings or something? Isn't there supposed to be a thing that pops up here? Maybe people complain it away. That happens. Ah, I have two yellow offers. So let's see, what can we get? Uh, text overflow. I will take that for 100. Let's see, scanning specialist. Silent running, efficient operations, intuitive mapping. That seems pretty useful. Alright, and this person. Speed, shield strength. Build it better. Hmm. Crafting's pretty powerful. I'll go with that. Oh, she is almost leveling up. I just need to find something to kill. I guess that, file, that person will be a uh, quest, probably. I'm Ensign Webb Hines, Operative Specialist. I was on a survey mission when my ship was destroyed. 
Can you take me to the space station in Sector 8? I've got a lead on some work there. I can only spare 325 credits, but I'll give you my lightly used grenade as payment. A <laughs> used grenade. <laughs> they scraped up the, all the pieces. Sure, but I know that's not how it works. All right. On, I need monsters to kill. Mmm, hearts. Dead pirates. Can't kill that, it's already dead. What's up? What's down here? Ah, nice. My intuitive mapping is working already. More zombies. Oh, and they look. They're vampiric. It means their attacks will, on me will heal them. Yep. So. Yeah, it's just this. Oh my. I think that's her, yeah? Yep. Remote. Ah, uh, reaction strike. So that means every time something melee hits me, I hit it back. For free. Doesn't. I still don't want to get hit. Nice. Let's rest. Hey, everybody. Right. Skill. Uh, teleport. Now that. I can I can even equip it because I have two yellow officers. Alright. E two. Uh -oh. That was wrong. Hull shears? Yes. So, I just installed hull shears, and I'm going to cut all these damaged walls and gather up the scrap metal. I have a pretty good store of scrap metal so far. I haven't really used it for anything. I'm waiting to see, I guess, if that other ship is repairable. Hey, there's a room. What's in there? Nothing super useful. Okay. Um, blow it up. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang on to that for a while. Exit should just let everything hang out for a bit. Let's see if they have a fire weapon. Yes, I will pay. Cure my disease. Thank you. All right. Flies. Crew. Battery dampener. I need that. Commodities. Sell the stuff I picked up. Plasma shield, eviscerator. Man, I could do a lot of striking back. But it really slows you down. Restock. Gyrojet rifle. Yes, please. That does explosive damage. Explosive is pretty hard to resist. Okay. Hammer. Hammer does knockback. Which is also good. I think right now I have a sword for my OAT. Yep, 74 damage. Yeah. Let's put That's pretty good defense, too. All I get here is parts. And if I sell it, I get a small amount of money. I think I'll take the parts. Okay, I'm going to keep everything else, not take a quest, I forgot to pay attention to whether I heal, but I don't think I do, I'm selling that thing to the Tentaculons, I have that quest, yep, let's go there. So, I want to sell this for 180,000 credits, and then I'll get 30,000 credits uh, as a quest reward and a new shield. 
All right, my artifact is gone. I got a ton of money now. Ton o money. They have no quests for me. Wham. They gave me a shield though. Let's see what the shield is like. 150. Man, they have the best stuff. Call the heck out of that. All right. Restock um, shotgun. It's good for like eyeballs and stuff. Rifle, gyrojet rifle. Sure, I'll put a shotgun in there. Ion grenade. Beamer! That is what I really want. But I'll keep the gyrojet around. One shot. The old rifle. Right. I will sell it. Approaching shop affinity. All right, now this is the ship that I'm looking at the concept of repairing. Yes, it is my first time using an incendiary weapon. I will be careful. Thank you for your concern. So the first thing I want to do is find out what's the status on this thing. Don't see one of those here. space for a second? Anybody else see that? It doesn't happen. Regardless of experimental uh, evidence to the contrary. All right, now Beamer takes them out from any any distance. That's great. Oh no, the propulsion feed exploded. Alright, so here's here's the damage. I think. Oh, another guy. I woke up with no memory of how I got here. Can you take me to the space station in Sector 9? I have an apartment there. I didn't know you could live at the space station. And he'll give me a grenade too. Friendly. Alright, so there's a lot of repair that needs done. Now, this here shows no life support, but it does show 100% air pressure. So that's definitely going to be a thing. If there's no life support system, I don't, I think it's probably going to fail to check. But like if it already has air pressure, yeah, you still need a life support system to run a ship. So, all right, no life forms here. Here's where the zombies were. I'm not scared of you now. I got a beamer. Like a laser rifle that shoots fire. Or like how a laser is actually Based. Maybe it's a maser. I love being able to build doors. I'm so glad they put that in the game. Oh yeah, I'm so glad I put that in the game. Another skill. Copy grenade. This deck. How much damage? Why does it say there's zero damage? I thought I just saw damage. Hey, look, man, there's damage right there. Alright, I'm getting very conflicting readings here because right here it says no, right here it says no atmosphere. And yet, when I look at one of those things, it says 100% uh, air pressure. 
So I'm thinking maybe the system is not infallible. And I should probably make a copy of this just in case I die so I can go back and fix whatever the heck is wrong in there. Alright. I don't know. I don't know which save number this is. Number seven? Two. Here, what's today? March 1st. 6 a.m. Well, that's right now. Okay. Copy that. Hopefully you can't see this. You're not like looking at my... Uh... I have to like, bring that up. Nope. You can't see what I'm doing. For all you know, I'm making it up. supplies. Hmm. Do I care about a Tentagulon quest? For money and XP, I do. I'm in Purpulating Stars. Here's another shipwreck. It's a shrimp carrier. It only has two decks. It shouldn't be repairable. Threat level is 69%. Maybe I can blow it up. I get tired of zombies. Let's see where the monsters are. Oh, lord. Well, I guess if I'm tired of zombies, there's Squither. Crafting manual. Also just got killed. My poor crew. You guys are tough. Okay, time to head back and get some oxygen. Too many of those things.
All right, so I can repair a fair amount of shipwreck stuff just by walking up to it because I have the hull shears, which fixes walls, and I have wreck tech skill on my sciency captain or like explorer captain. Hey, there's a lot fewer here. It's like well easier to handle. All right. Head back to the airlock so I can install that camera. The camera should work a lot better against squiddy larva. Yep, kills them right away. Doesn't really work against those things, but I do still have that nice laser gun. to increase my sight range so I could get range on those gloves. Okay, that should be explored enough to tow it to a station or else blow it up. Oh, well that was super dumb. Do whatever you want, I'm super dumb. Running real low on oxygen. Four, three, two. Ha ha, 159. Good easy. Okay, let's put a hole there. Alright. Oh hey, crafting manual. I want that. Zombie. Now, bludgeoning damage is not going to be as good against zombies as a sword was. Oh man. One more disease. You know, there should be some kind of some kind of long-term effects of diseases, even if they get cured. I just can't get in there. Maybe I don't need to. Auto-explore is great for picking up all that loot. Caves, technology, disease-free, human life. Um, and a quest? How could I not go to that planet? How am I doing? Am I ready to level up yet? I'm close. Because, see, what I'm thinking is I, I really want... I want to be able to pick up an officer instead of just having a quest to take him to a station. There they are, too. Let me, let me throw a grenade. No, no, don't do it. Oh, not me. Okay. All right, let's see how that thing likes fire. It seems like it doesn't. 
Oh, that plant wouldn't like it either. Uh oh. Looks like there might be a lot of oxygen on this planet. I sort of forgot about rampant fires. Look at all those raw ores. Aliens as a threat and ships as a resource. Huh, they are known to change priorities almost randomly. And turn off now. See? I swear I didn't write that, but it sure. It sure does apply. Wow, look at all this tech. Something, something crashed here for sure. Four or five devices. What a what a find. Whoops. Chief Seven Art. Transmuter. I would love to have a transmuter. Sidearm is payment. Okay. Man, this is really taking up all my quests too. Just gonna keep going back and forth. So I guess I better get on on the road, like. Of all that technology, I got myself yet another quest. So let's get out of here. Vector six. Don't have a quest there somehow. Got a couple of rescues here. Do that. Hopefully, I didn't just jump into some place I can't handle. All right, I'm in a uh, what's it called? Nebula. There's a ship. There's a banker. So, oh, hey, look. This is that secret feature I was talking about. I feel like no one has ever said anything about it because it should have always just been there. But I didn't used to have race pictures. So now, when they talk to you in their native language, you see a picture of them. Thank you, Bankership. That's so helpful. Oh, my. Cargo hold is full. Linaqui, haven't really met them yet. Cure the disease for 11,000. No problem. You have never seen such an incredible array of gray. That's the Linaqui. All right, so I got a, got a sidearm for that. Let's check that out. Ooh, it's a cloud gun. And I got this suit. Got a cloaking device? I bet I have a lot of, uh, a lot of money here. Let's look at salvaging some of these things. Here's a frag grenade. Um, about 50% better than what I have. I'm definitely, well, I'll look at the prices, I guess. Medical bay, that's useful. Hazmat shield has its uses. I wouldn't necessarily call it useful. My old sword. This. What's that? 34. 159. It looks like I have extra oxygen. Whatever, whatever. 170, 414. Well, it's a lot more hit points. A little bit more oxygen. I haven't been doing many plants. Maybe I should just put that on. Cloud gun's way better than a shotgun if you want to hit multiple targets. I'll carry a beamer. And that thing there. Turn here. Shotgun's not worth salvaging. Alright. Pawn shop. Biggest price? Cloaking device. Sell immediately. Artifact catalog, also pretty valuable. Cloak enhancer. 
hard call. I'll salvage them. Because I'm in a pretty good pretty good money situation. Let's see what I can do with the med bay. Rock plow, cargo, life support. I need the imperculators to do the Pentaculon quest. No, no more quests. I have business of my own. Alright, purple. Imperpulation. Purple, purple. Blasted settlement. Oh, was strange. I definitely just like teleported there. I'm gonna have to check the debug file here. We are the protectors of this galactic arm. Stay within the laws of decency and no harm will come to you. Yeah. That's what they think. Okay. So I think... I think... I'm gonna cut it off here. And take a look at those... issues... that I've discovered. Okay, this was cool. If you're watching this, thanks for watching. And if you're not, go to YouTube and watch this video. Possibly assuming, like, time travel works and the pause can come before the effect or after the effect. Hmm. I'm not sure how we're going to reconcile that. Watch the video. Thanks for watching the video. Goodbye.